the opening day of the 16th European Championships. 55 UEFA member states tried their hand at becoming the finest of them all. Now we are left with the 24 who have made it to these finals. Opening day certainly has a special feel to it. The atmosphere combustible but joyous as we usher in a new era for this competition together with the hopes and aspirations of all that take part. Worth reminding ourselves too that 2020 is the 60th birthday of these championships and it is for that special reason that the competition is being held right across the continent. This stadium has that feel of a genuine coliseum. It could only be Rome. That was impressive. Match that. Here it is then, the first page of the first chapter of this special tournament. All I hope is that these nations, as well as the players of course, can make a good account of themselves. And I also like the fact that such excitement isn't just something that one host country has the monopoly of. It's shared by so many people across the continent, literally, and that certainly created a, an extra special buzz. So we're up and running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Well, I'd go for Burak Yilmaz because he ticks plenty of boxes. He's aerially strong, he's good on the ball, links up well with the runners around him, and he has a certain amount of dead ball expertise too. There aren't many boxes left here. OK, interesting. Lorenzo Insigne. Benucci hoists it forward Locatelli great strength, too strong for his opponent Yilmaz is onto it and can take it up he gets past his man plays it back Bernadeschi displaying his defensive capabilities there that's no striker's tackle I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Under goes looking. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Oh, look, he's determined. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does it for him, Peter. Yilmaz with good energy in defence as well. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily... Big chance! One on one! Has a go! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Still, a crack in effort. Really looked like a man on a mission the way he went through on goal. And it's played forward. Florenzi. Berdeski. He's got away. Seems now to be all about wit. Berati is fouled. 
it's Ferrati. That is terrific skill. Lorenzo Insigne. Gorgeous control there. Up to meet it! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. He simply mistimed the header, and it was as if he knew it wasn't going to work out. Well, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Finds himself eased off the ball. Tufan has given away a free kick. Chalhanolu. And there, it is deadlocked. Referee's given a throw. Yokushlu, Yaziji. Oh, that's nice. Now, surely, and the ball's come out. And that's sprayed out wide. Chelhanolu. Yazici. It's come loose. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. Tufan. Under. It's got through and... Wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Under! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Well, the work rate to win the ball back was fantastic and it set up the opportunity. That's great effort. Marco Verratti. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Yokushlu. Chiellini. Lorenzo Insigne. Spinazzola. And it's Insigne. Tufan. Huckling down that right flank. He's got options out wide. And we hit half time. So the other team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of try. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. Interesting half. He's missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil now. And the second half gets on the way. Turkey clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Florenzi. Play for a throw. Here's the cross. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Chalamolu gets it away. 
driving on now. What can they conjure from here? He's left his man. Burek Yilmaz. Cut out in the nick of time. Marco Verratti. Jorginho. Forward it goes. Played out to the right. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Crosses it in. Up he gets! Big moment! Massive goal! That is a fine goal, really efficiently done. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Italy get themselves into the lead. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never the one to let you down in these situations. Bonucci plays it forward. Jorginho. Turkey still chasing a one-goal deficit here. Now, can he cap it off? Goes for goal! Mobile really was well marshaled there because he was denied the opportunity to to turn And he's shown him a clean pair of heels That's what has to be done now. No question about it. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this It really is a question of needs must just has to be done It's an untidy challenge free kick given and he's going to have his name taken. Knocks it away. Yokushu drives it forward. And here's Immobile. Oh, he's pr it's Immobile! Good stop. That wasn't easy. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Appearance and very necessary. Spinazzola just brushed off the ball there. Jorginho. And it's Yilmaz. Now it's Immobile. Tries to get it forward quickly. Put it, Yilmaz! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Jorginho. Trust the field, it goes. Done. Chiellini does well there, alert, and helps available out wide. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. And here's Burak Yilmaz. There are a few waiting for it. Well, when the options aren't quite present in the box, it's the crosser's interest to uh, to hold on for the support. Tufan. And here's Chalhanolu. It's broken loose. It's Chalhanolu! Should have equalised. Chalhanolu appears to be absolutely seething with himself after squandering the chance to equalise. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. 
Lorenzo Insigne gets away from his opponents. Italy can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Yilmaz making use of the space out wide. Has a hit! Same again, same outcome. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. Italy are making a change now. Jorginho. Emerson. Chiesa. Tufan. Under. Burak Yilmaz. Chiellini. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Turkey have had their life made a little tougher. Defeat first up only adds to the pressure to win from now on in. Your final thoughts, Jim? Listen, sometimes... Going... Well, it is only the second game in the group phase, but already this is crunch time for some. Certainly those who have suffered defeat in their opening game. The prospect of an early exit already hangs above their heads. The players and managers have to put a brave face on it in the pre-match press conference, but that is not going to change the overwhelming truth here, and that is that they really must seek to avoid defeat. No question that this is one of the great capital venues of the Netherlands, the Johan Cruyff Arena, Amsterdam. And so, the national anthems. Some in the media have dubbed this already a desperation derby. Well, it doesn't have to be doom and gloom simply because you've lost one game. That can be rescued quite quickly here, and with a great chance of, of turning fortunes round and, and lifting spirits and just creating much more optimism. And they can still emerge from this group. Their hopes and dreams are very much alive from the way I see it. So it's down to business here. Your Kushlu has given away a free kick. Ramsey gets it back. Gets the better of his man. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Tries to get it forward quickly. Chance! It's off target and by quite a way. Wales are looking quite mean on the counter, and combating that requires even more meanness.
Referee's given a throw. Very well to intervene. Wales have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Oh, real danger here! Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. Resici. Yazici. And the header! Just off target. Under certainly could have and should have made more of that. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Allen. And it's Yilmaz. And it's been taken straight back. And it's got through. Yazici. Yazici's cross. Fail. And the counter is on. And that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Chalhanolu. Well, that's where he wants it. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. Plays a clever pass. Oh, that's clever. And that has been clubbed away. Focus then on the defensive side of his game. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Davis hoists it forward. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. Chalhanolu, Under, forward it goes. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. That intervention was very necessary. Drives it towards the front. That's not going to make it. Under. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Oh, he's got out of play. Forward tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help him. So Inju with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. And here's Ramsey. Yazici sticks in a foot to win it back. Good run through the middle, but he needs support. Yilmaz plays it out to the wing. Oh, that's neat. Looking for a decent ball. Meets it first time! Good move in there, but not the best of finishes. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Davis. Now it's Bale, played out to the right. There's the end of the first half.
And both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. The first half. Well, there's one standout, Peter, that needs improving, and, and that's the passing. All too often it's been found wanting, you know, much to the frustration of, of everyone around. And I'd, I'd go so far as to say that it's the biggest contributor as to why we have the scoreline we do. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil there. And we're already back on the way here. Turkey clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. And it's played forward. It's beautifully weighted. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? He's put it on the right. Now, what's on? Yazici. Has a pop! Again, let me mention what a wonderful stop the goalkeeper pulled off there. Really wonderful. In up! So calm under pressure. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a meal the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, oh, you've got him, no, you don't. Brilliant. Turkey take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Ball is over the line. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. And it's Allen. A nice touch. Aimed in towards the centre. Wales showing more urgency now and to be honest Peter this is what's required well, this isn't the time to Yilmaz is fouled Couldn't stay down for him. Well, that was just asking too much of himself from there. Across the field it goes. And here's Bale. Bale's cross. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. Turkey, get it back again. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Allen. Allen goes looking. Yokushvi. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Yazici. 
Turkey are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. Battles to win it back. Yazici. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? And the through ball is intercepted. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, the idea was right, the delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Turkey certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. Soon Chu plays it forward. Oh no, that's not the ball he wanted. Keeper sends it forward. Turkey just have to run down the clock. Well played, he saw that coming. Yasichi. Kalanolu, there he goes, motoring forward. And that's it. Turkey win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. Oh, they really needed that. Nothing decided yet, but they are... Turkey emerging for this crucial group game here, the tournament still in its relative infancy. But it is already developing into quite a spectacle, and that, of course, is what you expect from this, the greatest of all the tournaments. It has been terrific stuff so far, so let us hope that the trend continues here and now. One glance, and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Just joining us, we are already on the way. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Well, I'd go for Burak Yilmaz, because he takes plenty of boxes. He's aerially strong, he's good on the ball, links up well with the runners around him. And he has a certain amount of dead ball expertise, too. There aren't many boxes left here. OK, interesting. Under. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. That's gone a long way up and away. And it's played forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Could be a chance here. It's wrestled off the ball. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. Hoists it forward. Xhaka plays it forward. And here's Seferovic out to the right. Gone behind for a goal kick. Turkey, so far, providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Under. Cuts it out. Tried to play it through. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. 
And it's Chalhanolu. And there. Cut out in the nick of time. Well read, he sorted that out. Forward it goes. Done very well to intervene. Under. Under drives it forward. Away from immediate danger. And that's been one straight back. Seferovic. Chalhanolu, Tufan, Under, Yazici, Yazici! Clearance and very necessary. Swung over into the middle. Too much on it and out of play. Rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. And it's Yilmaz. He's left his man. This was gone, that's uh, foul. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Half-time nearly with us. They will be desperate not to concede here. And we have the first dead ball situation of the game. Promising one. Gets good distance on it. Gets it back. Yasichi. Forward it goes. And here's Burak Yilmaz. Burak Yilmaz. And the first 45 minutes are up. So the other team has broken through. And it's to try. It's an interesting game up to now. But still goals. The midway point of the game. Ended up for it's Yilmaz and he's done it. And now it's all about how they handle this from here. Edging ahead again in the second half is best followed up with a, a bold mindset, a bold approach. The skipper set the example. It's up to his teammates now to follow. That's wonderfully done. Chris Pitch, true finish. Burak Yilmaz really showed his coolness, Peter, by not getting flustered on, on such a tough skill. And for me, it was controlled perfection. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Tries to get it forward quickly. Did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Yilmaz provides an outlet. Oh, that is rather wayward. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. <laughs> 
Seferovic. Granit Xhaka. Xhaka spreads it towards the left. That will be a corner. Under battles to win it back. Under conjuring up some magic on the right hand side. Oh, lots to admire in the run and the defending. Oh, the defense got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. <laughs> Yaziji. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Granit Xhaka. And it's Xhaka. Looking for space out wide. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Borek Yilmaz. Switzerland getting a lot of touches here, but they're not making much progress. Seferovic just brushed off the ball there. Under is onto it and can take it up. Gets away from his opponent. There are a few waiting for it. He's had a goal! Fair effort, he reacted well. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Seferovic is there to heave it away. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Tries a shot! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Switzerland have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Penetration to go with all this possession. The only goal came in the early moments of the second period, and it's 1 0. And it's Seferovic. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Looking to force his hit one! Switzerland are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? He's got options out wide. Under. So who's he picking out? Going for goal! I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. And the referee's awarded a free kick. Turkey need to hold on for a few more moments. And it's played forward. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. That could spell trouble. Turkey clearly seem to have lost their passing accuracy, something they're obviously going to have to fix pretty quickly now.
keeper sends it forward. Resici. And the referee brings it to a close. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal in it. But that was enough. Well, hello and welcome to everybody who's tuning in from around the world. I'm sure that you can sense a very different feeling in atmosphere and ambience around the ground, certainly by comparison with what we've seen before in this year's competition. Gone now are second chances, points and tables, that sort of thing confined to the group stage. From this point on, nothing other than a win suffices. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Pogba. Hoists it forward. Yokushlu. And it's Ben Yedda. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. A real chance and a real let-off. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Pogba. Griezmann. Mbappe. Shot a goal! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Mbappe sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Pogba. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Longley. He's got away. It's Griezmann! <laughs> Towering header! Just off target. Mbappe certainly could have and should have made more of that. Griezmann. Turkey so far providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Well weighted. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. He's one on one, surely hits one! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class weight. Challenge, but has a shot. Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Turkey have found chances hard to come by, so that's perfectly understandable. Moran switches it towards the other side. Just brushed off the ball there. He's found his man, Burek Yilmaz. 
wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Forward it goes. Mbappe! Big relief, it just needed better contact. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. Rafael Varan. And it's played forward. Under tries to get it forward quickly. For a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Hoists it forward. It's got through to him. Has a hit! Oh, shame, that was nicely worked. Burak Yilmaz surely had to be sharper in making the most of his one-on-one. -on -one. It's not as if it's his first time, either. Across the field it goes. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Conte. That's surely a foul free kick. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Hernandez. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Now a chance to break. Going through. On there. Loris can pick that up. Rafael Varan. It's an entertaining game, this. Both teams have had chances, but it is still nil-nil. He goes long. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Keeper sends it forward. Mbappe. Mbappe unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Under. Rafael Varan. Pogba. And here's Ben. Shoots! Ben Yedder usually is so good from that. And it's the whistle for half time. And both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Midway point of the game. A very entertaining half, Peter. Uh, the game's been played at a... He's gone for it! <laughs> Hit into the middle. Loris has that under control. Griezmann. France ran themselves into the proverbial cul-de-sac there. Over to the left. Well played, he saw that coming. And it's played forward. Under! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Rafael Varane. Pogba tries to get it forward quickly. Good take. It's Ben Yedda! Oh, denied brilliantly. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Lovely bit of skill. Well positioned to make that interception. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. Mbappe. He's tried one. 
straight at the keeper. Griezmann quickly realised that he could have a pop, not his best. Yazici hits that low. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Under has a goal! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Oh, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Yeah, and he has to change his ways, or this referee could soon change his status. Up he gets! It goes to show he is human after all. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. France making consecutive changes here. Forward it goes. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. Kante tries to stroke it through. Gets it back. He's made sure that that won't get through. Riesman goes looking. Chalhanolu. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just the... Oh, Mbappe! He's pulled off a fine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. And it's Chalhanolu. He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. That was close. France being made to look sloppy in possession here. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Hoists it forward, cuts it out. France showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Yazici battles to win it back. Gets the better of his man. Yazici, he's had a shot. Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Fence has got rid of that. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Baran gets it forward. Yasichi, he's picked him out, and the through ball is intercepted. So nothing between them in 90 minutes, and we are in for extra time. Well, no, no, it doesn't offer a fair reflection of what we've seen. The game's been vibrant, I think the atmosphere has remained buoyant, and we just need the scoreline to, to step into line. So 90 minutes couldn't produce a winner, and we have extra time. We are already back on the way. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Havar tries to get it forward quickly. 
And it's played forward. Mbappe has been fouled. Steered forward. Chelhanolu. Burak Yilmaz. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. Turkey clearly aren't looking comfortable on the ball at the moment. Predictability has just crept into their play. Longley. He's played him through. Oh, what a ball! Mbappe! Oh, that's a fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Dinya crosses. This was gone. That's a foul. Yokushlu knocks it away. And helps available out wide. Gets wrestled off the ball. And that's it for the first half of extra time. And we have to accept the penalties are now a realistic possibility. I think that either side is set. Three penalties can be. Players are evidently tired, and it may come to that. And if you're just back, the action is back on the way already. Nil nil still. Play to win or play for penalties. Pogba plays it forward. Turkey really are almost trying to pass the ball through a brick wall at the moment. You can see the sense of anxiety has, has now shifted to the stands. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Pavar drives it forward. Aran gets it back. Martial. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And shoots! Martial turns and goes back. France to make one last surge forward. It's come loose. Timely into the real chance! A great save, real class. Mbappe really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. And that's been levered clear. wonder if that's it now but there may be one more opportunity Peter for a late late steal here still inseparable we have penalties yeah, and at least they both had a go at winning it in extra time it's often the opposite yeah, the players look exhausted but one last act we're back in a moment for penalties Right on the edge. Feel the moment. Mbappe will go first. And he's found the net. 
looks like he's done it a thousand times, never looked like missing. So he walks up to the spot and puts the ball down. And so the captain steps up. Cooley done, one each. He just did what he was asked. So, the second man in line. Great stop, keeper's denied him. I think the keeper's done really well to save that. He deserves a pat on the back from his teammates. Yazici is the second man to step up for his team. Our oh, keeper's gone the right way, but can't keep it out. France looking to draw level. No, it's been saved! That's a lovely stop from the keeper. He's done his teammates proud with that one. Turkey looking to extend their advantage. Oh, he saved it! Well, that's great concentration from the keeper and a wonderful save. From one behind. Oh, what a save! Oh, that's a super save from the keeper. This then to seal it. I oh, saved it! Oh, that was right down the keeper's throat, and it was an easy save to make in the end. So it's down to him to keep it alive. Saved it! And that's won it! Turkey advance. Oh, stern tests await, no doubt. What are your thoughts on today's game, Benjamin? Look, it's a first obstacle jump, and they could feel optimistic about the potentially tougher challenges that lay ahead now. While well, all observers are agreed on this, it is the point where the competition gets really serious. Top teams now fielding their best available lineups in front of big, big crowds, a lot of noise, great expectation, and the sense that the possibility of silverware is at hand. This is a big chance. Certainly, this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. They stand for the national anthem of Poland. Impressive match that There is a, a perceptibly greater sense of urgency from both sides here with uh, a place in the last four on the line. All the eight sides still left here are perfectly entitled to think they have a good shot at this, Peter. 
It is quite an atmosphere here, and that's clearly raised the bar in terms of expectations from the crowd. They genuinely think, or certainly the feel is, that they'll get to see the game of the tournament. That gets things running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. He can make the difference. Yeah, Robert Lewandowski. He's just about the perfect all-round striker. Not least because he can finish equally well with both feet, Peter. It's not all about his finishing, though. He's always on the shoulder, looking for that ball in behind. And that prevents the opposition defence from getting too high or, indeed, getting too comfortable. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. That's a throw. In by Charanolu. And that is not finding anyone. Koviak. Chalanolu gets it back. It's a throw. He's through and it's Yilmaz! Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if... He didn't have people nearby. Just brushed off the ball there. Yazidji, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Goes for it! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Click. Yazici battles to win it back. Yazici looking to run onto it. Great lead! Thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the train again because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really can look forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Hoists it forward, and here's Lewandowski. There's a long ball. Oh, good interception. This has gone, that's a uh, foul. He can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. Yaziji. Oh, sweet feet. Yokushlu. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1 0. Chelhanolu. Koviak. Click.
Zielinski. Under the scorer already in the game. Out to the right. He's got away. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Klich. The referee's awarded a free kick. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Lewandowski has a goal! Chalhanolu. Yazici. There's the cross. Cut out in the nick of time. Gets wrestled off the ball. Yokushlu. That's the throw. Kukoviak. Chalhanolu. And it's the whistle for half time. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. Still had its moments. And ultimately produced just one goal. A a decent game up to now. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Turkey in for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Already up and running for the second half. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. And no, that's not the ball he wanted. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Yazici, he's going to run down the left wing. Forward it goes. Shapes to shoot! Oh, surely that deserved better. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. to get it forward quickly. Lewandowski! He's done very well to get to that. Lewandowski really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Goalkeeper's ball. And it's been taken straight back. Foot in. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. Just brushed off the ball there. Now it's Burak Yilmaz going through. Burak Yilmaz. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. Has a hit! So, Jim, what are you thinking? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Poland showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. 
Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Yazici. Dinks one in. And that's got paid to a promising move. And it's Chalhanolu. Burek Yilmaz has come loose. Cleared without complication. Up to meet it! No, he didn't quite meet it right. Nick looks to get on the end of this. What a delicate ball. That had to be more accurate. Yokushu brings it forward. Burek Yilmaz. It's Yilmaz! Oh, and that should have been two. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he'll be desperate to get another. Yaziji drives it forward. And it's played forward. That will annoy the manager. They're making themselves too predictable here. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. Burak Yilmaz. It's good distance on it. Nicely measured pass. Well positioned to make that interception. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. And he's shown him a clean pair. Hits one! And he nearly went all the way. It off in fitting style, but he couldn't make it fit. It's going to be a double change then. Tries to get it forward quickly. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. <laughs> Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Turkey through to the last four. Just two more steps now. They have got a crack at it.